Ryan Dion is still on the road to mental health recovery. She's starting the whole process again. But he doesn't let it stop him from helping others. Are you getting on the bike once a, once a day? Oh, no, yeah, once a day. Like it sort of validates your own recovery, right? That, you know, what I am doing is, in fact, you know, something that is helpful, is valid. So you're going to walk for half? Ryan runs the peer recovery support group at CMHA Winnipeg, a one-of-a-kind program in the city. Rather than one-on-one -on -one meetings, participants talk talk about personal negatives, positives and goals in groups while getting feedback. I was spending a lot of time implementing stuff at home or just doing things on my own, just writing stuff down or trying different things and I thought, you know, <clears throat> Why couldn't we do this in a classroom setting? Members benefit from the group conversations. So how do you word those goals in the context of SMART goals? You're participating more. You're, uh, you're not just sitting back being taught. You're, you're participating, you're sharing, and you're getting the feedback from others that you're really not alone in this. See, I was on the bike for an hour. In a group setting, it really helps people to sort of, you know, make that concrete and feel confident enough to put something like that forward and to see that there are other people doing the exact same thing. So we got coffee on, uh, on Friday. A history of anxiety and depression brought Ryan to CMHA where he's participated in several programs. He's implemented a number of healthy lifestyle changes. You can get to some very, very dark places and you can be stuck and it's, it's not good. Ryan has also started a new website featuring a forum where group members and others can interact. This is how we kind of get the word out. The recovery continues for Ryan. Helping others improve at the same time makes his road easier. When you get to seeing people being able to sort of address it and to look at it and to sort of move past the illness or at least move on from just being stuck and dwelling on certain things. It's just, it's really rewarding because, you know, you've been there. Your morning routine, your, you know, yep. you, you can set it up however you want. For Go Winnipeg, I'm Kevin Hirschfield. Set up and the amount of time these things take.